Oh boy, I'm ready. This is Sen. Sound effects necessary. We're playing Tales of Symphonia. And uh, ooh, this monster over here. We're gonna artfully run right into it. Let's get started. Yeah. Smack, smack, smack. Don't ever do it. Demon first aid. Demon bang. Don't overdo it. Demon bang. Like that? Yeah, you like that? Don't overdo it. First aid. Demon bang. Yeah. Wooden sword. Just as I expected. Let's cook. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, we're good. I forgot about that. It's sealed. The sorcerer's ring can probably open it. It's enshrined in this temple. Where is it? It's in the temple. All right. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh. I made a mistake. Let's go all I out. Hot um, I don't want to punch that one. Nope. Uh, slime. Yeah, don't overdo it. Demon Ray! Ah. Uh, so, um, this game, it was, um, you were on a track, basically left and right. There's no, like, running around the Don't overdo it. Unless you, like, select a different enemy and run past them, or you can lock and jump over them. What? Yeah, I can't jump over this guy. He's full. He's a little floaty. Keep working on it, okay? Uh, ooh, Magic lens. We're good. Okay. Um, and this, I think, was one of the last games to do the track. Because Tales of Symphonia has been around since... Um, the earliest one I played was on the Game Boy Advance, which was a 2D side-scrolling uh, battle. Like, you'll run through a map, top-down, kind of. And then you get into a battle, and it's a, like a left-to-right flat plane. So this was like, wow, it's an arena! And in the most recent game that came out, Tales of Asteria. Um, it's seamless battle, and you just run, and then, like, monsters load in, and you fight in the area. You don't have, like, this little arena. Looks um, really also collected small. a thing. Uh, hey, don't overdo yeah, it! Hey, uh, hey. Hey. Quack. Quack. Uh, Demon Fang! Hey. 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 Oh, hey. hey. oh, hey. hey. Whoa! Don't yeah, uh, nice hey. job, Genius. You learned the spell. Hey. Hey. Demon Fang! Uh, hey. Get him! Jump don't back. Laugh. Yeah. Watch this! Oh. Sonic Thrust! I learned a sonic Just thrust. Just as I expected. Yeah, prepare to sandwich. Wow, it turned into a rock. Oops. Oh. Uh. Oh, I see. I see. I don't get it. I have to fight the guys. They'll turn into blocks. And then I drop the blocks down. Wonderful. I need to do one, no, two up here, and one over here. And I'm not going to do the ones on the sides. Here comes more of them! Hot tea! I work! I didn't get hit. Okay. Don't overdo it. Ouch. Smack, smack, smack. Demon bang! Demon bang! Oh yeah, how do I do Sonic Thrust? So that's up. Yeah. Demon fang! Hey, Demon fang is my thing. Okay, so let's grab it. Here. There we go. Sweet. One more. And there we go. Uh, first dungeon. Don't you guys Demon let up? Demon Fang! Demon Fang! Demon Fang! Don't overdo it! First aid! Demon Fang! Demon Fang! Demon Fang! Demon Backwards. Don't overdo it. Demon first aid. Ouch. Get him. Fireball. Good. Die. I killed a rock. Just as I expected. All right. Ugh. Repetitive. 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 Okay, push it up. There we go. Got one more, and then we're good. Same. Not caring about the side. Though. One right after another. Demon Fang! Whack. Demon Fang! Whack. Get him! Don't let him! Ray Thrust! Take this! First aid! Ouch. As much as I want to play Genius, I think it'd be far more interesting to watch me play if I were to play as uh, the melee character. Ray Thrust! Yeah, there we go. 
I might lower volume as well so I can talk more during battles. <laughs> but kind of quiet, because, you know, you know, um, focused on the game. This is a fun game. Have I mentioned that? It's a fun, fun game. It came out shortly after Final Fantasy X, and I haven't played much of Final Fantasy X, but apparently has, like, a bajillion of the, ooh, a bajillion of the same, uh, storyline plots and stuff. I was able to guess most of the Final Fantasy X storyline after half an hour and be like, wait, is this, that, that, this, and this, and that? My friend's like, how'd you know? And I'm like, Tales of Symphonia. Alright, so now, basically, uh, the, uh, I found the Sorcerer's Ring. There's one in every Tales of game. Okay, so now I can do this. Boop. Boop. Sweet. Now what I can do with that is I can do something amazing. Where it allows me to. Wait, where is this foot? Oh, wait, the button. Mm. There we go. They turn blue, and I can touch them without them fighting me. It's great. Ooh, and I go. And I go. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Let's get started. Hot Next take. Get Don't ever do it. Demon this day. Sonic Rush. Hot take. Yeah. Hot take. Demon Fang. Here we go. Hot like take. Demon Fang! Take this! Demon Fang! Oh my god, you're such a poser, Kratos. Get out of here. Sonic Rush! Demon Fang! That's right. Take that You face. picked the wrong guy to mess with. Alright, so let me explain this. Experience, bonus, max hit. Uh, Gal is gold. They replaced the vowel with a different one. Time, and then grade. Grade is the only one I need to explain, really. At the end of the game, and at some points during the game, I can spend grade to get some pretty nice stuff. Um, during the game, I can get materials with it, and at the end of the game, I can unlock stuff for my new game plus sort of thing. Um, you get like 10,000 grade for just beating the game, and then they let you buy stuff. So that way you always have stuff to buy. And if you have 30,000 grade, you can unlock a thing where you get 10 times the experience. And there's some battles in this game that you're not you're meant going to win. Down. You're just supposed to, like, straight die. Yeah, 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 yeah. With that, after playing the game, like, three times through, you can unlock these other possibilities. So there's so hard battles, but blah, blah, blah. There we go. Never had a chance. Kill stealer. Ah, all right, so let's lower the volume. Oh yeah, synopsis. This gets like tells the entire story, and it gets really long because um, there are a whole bunch of story points that it goes over. Volume settings, uh, battle voice volume. Let's bring it down to this. Battle, battle sound effects. No, let's keep it there. All right. Woohoo! Just for the show. Oh. Oh. Let's get this over with. Demon. There we go. Don't overdo it. Okay. It'll be nice when I have more abilities, but all I got is the measly abilities at the moment. I wonder if there's like special tricks to speedrunning this game. Like I know that people like hack files and stuff so that they can do crazy things. Or if there's also like just some abilities you can use in certain orders. Uh, is everybody okay? But I want to know what it's like for this game. Yeah, but where are th why are there so many monsters in the temple? It's a part of the chosen trial. Won't you wear that when you decided to come to join her? Yeah, I'm Kratos. I have no nose. Of course I knew that. I'm sorry, it's my fault you're here. Don't worry about it. It's for the sake of bringing peace to the world. Thank you, Lloyd, the man who's not getting paid to do this. Dwarven vow number one, right? I just told you to stop bringing those up. You only brought them up. Um, sweet. Apple gel. That's a healing item. Life bottle, that's a revive item. And 250 gal. That's a gold. But gal, because we're clever. <laughs> Alright, let's go over here. By the way, um, I hope this music is okay on your ears. Oh, because that is the only dungeon music really in the game. So have fun with that. Wow. 
And uh, also, Genus just called out, found your weakness, which means that these monsters, or the spiders, are weak to fire, which is very handy that they let you know. And if you use the opposite element, they're not weak to overdo it. They will say like, oh, what the heck? And it's not very effective, so yeah. Um, also, if they do different things, if one party member heals another, a specific party member, whoop! Oh wait, whoop! Then they will like thank each other, and it's super nice that they have this like character dialogue in battles. Oh, is that all the Sorcerer's Ring does? You get bored so easily. Oh lloyd, ha ha ha. Uh, righty righty. This yes. appears to be the top floor. Yes, that's the altar. Mm-hmm. Then that shining thing there must be the Crucius Crystal. Mm-hmm. That's right. They say I was born with that in my hand. Ooh. Look at that light! Oh, good. I apologize for this next character. It's Navi. Just kidding. It's Lord Remiel. Yep, Lord Remiel. There you are. He is the doofiest angel I've ever seen. Meh. I'm Lord Remiel. <gasps> what is that? Yeah, it's Lord Remiel. An angel, I would assume. Really lame angel. They get, so, is that Colette's of, real father? You see a lot of angels in this game. And they all look really awesome. They look so cool. Except Lord Remiel. He's the doofiest I angel. I am Remiel. I am an angel of judgment. An angel of stupid. Look at look at him. Ugh. Got these puny little wings, a stupid like air face. The time has come to awaken the goddess Martel, His who face... sleeps at the center of the world. His face looks like one of those RPG games that you'll do, or like MMO games, and like you haven't customized the main character's face yet. And it's just like generic face, you know? Awaken the goddess Martel. It's just like the legend Rain told us about. It's as if she didn't lie to us all those years. What a nice person. Ah, your low resolution wings hurt my eyes, Remiel. Step up your game, man. Oh, oh, it's gonna touch her. Oh. Ah. He could have just handed it to her. Sweet. She's got a pretty necklace now. From this moment, Colette becomes the chosen of regeneration. Ooh. We of Crucius bless this event and hereby bestow the Tower of Salvation upon Silverant. Crucius is the Order of the Angels, just so you know. And that is a giant tower that somehow doesn't fall over. Don't ask. It apparently leads up to heaven. So beautiful. So that's the Tower of Salvation. So that's the Leaning Tower of Salvation. Now the world will be saved! Unless it falls over. Colette, the Chosen of Regeneration. That would suck if it did. I wonder what it's made out of to not fall over. Yes? Can I continue the... I humbly accept this task. Yes, okay, there we go. Very good. We of Crucius shall grant you the power of the angels with each seal you unlock. Sweet. Once you are reborn as an angel, this eroded world shall be regenerated. Cool. Thank you. I swear on my life I will regenerate the world. Is it like an over, like an instant thing, or is it over time that the world regenerates? First, head south to the Seal of Fire. Offer your prayers in that distant land. What if I want to do that one last? Yes, Lord Remiel. Which I can't, but he's very demanding. Oh, wait! Oh. Please wait! Nope, I'm leaving. Gotta go take a poo. I have a question I wish to ask of you. Make fast, I gotta Are poo. Are you really my fa- My fa- First, head to the Seal of Fire. Understood, my beloved daughter Colette. <sighs> I'm sorry, Colette. Father! So you really are my true father. We gotta shall meet again take at the dog. next seal, my daughter. I'll call later this week. Gotta, gotta, oh, how do I get in? 
gonna be a big one! Bye, Remiel, bye! I'm just gonna leave. You received the Oracle. Let us leave now, Chosen. Oh, yes. We're going on ahead. La da 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 da. Wah! Uh, thank you, both of you. Please stop by my house later. Bye, Colette, I guess. Peace out! She left. The rumor was true. What rumor? That Colette is the daughter of an angel, not really related to her current father, Frank. Even if you're not related by blood, family is family. Ah, Lloyd, your morals are so good. At least that's what I think. Mar ah, Lloyd. I'm sorry, Marley just like did a thing. My phone popped up, so I called Lloyd Marley. I'm sorry, Marley. Oh, I, I'm i sorry. Hey, don't worry about it. I'm walking here. You'll understand what that means very soon. Um, it's not that much like a spoiler. Just when we get to Lloyd's house. <gasps> Marvelous. She's got stars in her eyes. Professor? <gasps> oh. What are you two doing here? You're supposed to be studying in class. <gasps> Uh-oh. Rain, I'm sorry. Uh, this is corporal punishment. Dang. You're an exploit. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Spank me, Rain. Spank me. Yeah. Waka! Oh. That wasn't a... You just, like, drop kicked your student. Now, you two, if you've learned your lesson, go back home. There will be no class for the rest of the day because you have to recover from a concussion. What about you? I'll be meeting with the police after what I've done. <laughs> but, but, bye. <laughs> what was that? I'm sure it wasn't the last person in the temple that we saw. Yeah, right. This is a long episode, but we got some fun story stuff. Colette is a daughter of an angel. Ooh. Um, Lloyd's thoughts on angels. I'll do this real quick. So, angels really do have wings. Yeah, just like the scriptures in the Church of Martell. But, you, you know, I bet it's a hassle when they have to change their clothes. Huh? I, I guess so. And you'd have to make holes in your clothes for the wings to go through. Oh, Lloyd, asking the serious questions. Lloyd is the only common sense thinker. Yeah, I mean, aren't you curious? I wonder if they have get the, in the way when they sleep. Being an angel is pretty inconvenient, huh? Yep, I suppose so. Yeah, human supremacy. Oh, Lloyd. Always got his head right on the ground. Oh, the journey. Let's, what's Colette going to do now? The, that angel told her to release the seals and she'll become an angel. Hmm, okay. So Colette's going to leave the village. Aww. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Oh, please. Haha! -ha. Like, comment, subscribe. It makes my day wonderful, and I hope you have a wonderful day too. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Uh, save point. Actually, goodbye now. Goodbye.